Hello again, Internet. It's the two fat guys on the Internet. I am Dan Pansig. That's Tony Schultz. Uh, oh, now it's done. We got this fucking idiot robot over here. Where the fuck are we? Oh, fiddlesticks. More humans. Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> We're We're, fire. Wherever he goes, there's humans everywhere, and he hates it. This is a very special episode. We're doing it at a remote location at our are. friend of the show, Robbie's house. Say hello, Robbie. Hello. Here we go. Hey, Robbie, if I kill these humans in your home, will you set me free into the great Ethernet cable in the sky? <laughs> mm, probably not. Oh, fuck. Fuck him, I'm Kill me. Kill me now. <laughs> Please just end my horrible life. Come on, man. It ain't it's dead, not so bad. Fuck, will send you to the junkyard. Oh, oh fuck, junkyard. <laughs> you don't like traveling with us, huh? I hate traveling, especially with you fat dickweeds. <laughs> of course. Of course. Well, uh, Robbie's also going to let us taste upon his wonderful recipe of jailhouse burritos. Yeah. I can't fucking wait. I'm excited <laughs> personally. Very excited. Yeah, if you listen to the interview from our good friend Tubbs at the punk picnic, he gave the recipe. And uh, today is the day, folks. At long last. Yes, sir. It's been a minute since I made some, but... I'm sure it'll come all. It'll come back to me. Yeah, oh, so it's, fuck, like, yeah. it's like yeah, it's like it's like riding a bike. It's right? like riding a prison oh, bicycle. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> how, how hard is it to push a button on a microwave and heat something up? And exactly. Well, there's together. there's some people out there who I don't think have mastered it yet. Right. But, uh, <laughs> I'm gonna slurp that thing down just like giving <laughs> eggs to that Edith Massey. <laughs> oh God, yes, Edith Massey. I just want some eggs. Where's the egg man? I want eggs. Give me eggs. <laughs> <laughs> you remember that thing, Pinful Man? No, I, oh, it's I disturbing. It's a beautiful movie, really. <laughs> There's a rape with a live chicken in between. <laughs> there there, there it's, is. It's a great John a Waters movie. Movies. It is. It really is. <laughs> beautiful is what it is. <laughs> that's a disturbing a, type of humor, right? Yeah, yeah. That's a creepy one coming out of the woodwork there. <laughs> what the fuck? Is that from, like, Termites? Is that where that's from? What, Coming out, out of the, the woodwork? woodwork? Yeah. I don't know, man. That that term came out of the woodwork. Do you have cell service? Do you have? Uh, are you able to go on the internet? Uh, I I can probably try. Let's see. There I can go. go on there. Where's the internet machine? Well, let's let's look up where out of the woodwork came yeah, from. Yeah, I'm curious. Can we a little theme music? Let's see. What do we What do we want here? Thank you. Some good detective work here. As he looks, with his fingers moving in a near pace of epic proportion. I'm typing as he hard as I can and into hard. my phone. He makes a look for everyone, for your knowledge, for our knowledge. Uh, let's see here. The interior wooden fittings, especially of a house as doors, stairways, or moldings, come out of the woodwork, informal, to appear or materialize suddenly and unexpectedly. Uh, that's not an origin at all. That's just a definition. Uh, oh, I fucked up. I fucked up. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, boy. Fuck. Uh, Fuck. Oh, it's, it's, dude, it totally comes from termites. Oh, okay. All right. Well, yeah. they do come out of the woodwork. From the idea of insects crawling out from the inside of the woodwork in a house. Motherfucking bugs. Shit. Yeah, boy. Now you know. Everybody's learned a thing today. Speaking of coming out of the woodwork, we got a new segment for you, Dan. Oh, God. It's called Fat Files. Oh, God. With some sexy theme music. Fat Files. <laughs> <laughs> the right. Fat File for today consists of my day on Tuesday. Mm. I woke up, uh, had a bit of a stumble down the stairs, and I went to take a grab of this railing to keep myself upright, <laughs> and, uh... The railing decided, eh, eh, and he fucking broke. I fucking fell straight on my back. I could slid down all the way down. This Wonderful. Shit. That was awesome. That was your, your fat guy moment for the week? Yeah, That's yeah. I told Man. <laughs> if I wasn't fat, the rail probably should have and would have helped. You'd think so. Ha, 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 you fat fucking pathetic dickweed. Ha, 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 ha. Wow, yeah, <laughs> that's, did, I mean, man. he got you. <laughs> he sure did, man. So, you know, that was, uh, that was a that's, thing. That's the fat files, huh? I wish I had something fat to contribute myself. Fat files. It's <laughs> <laughs> a great theme, though. That's a great theme. You, you ever notice when people, like, 
they're like you they hear you say something and they disapprove and yeah. they're like uh, if you can't say anything nice don't say anything at all no no say not nice things that's the only way people are going to know that they're fucking being dickweeds but to, I, to quote a robot friend of mine right i call it bullshit though because fucking just that act of fucking scolding them and shit isn't really uh, that a, nice it's like a judgment and yeah, yeah. It's, it's being pretty fucking uncool you didn't have to say it you're trying to demean a motherfucker son of a bitch son of a fucking don't bitch. tell me not to say it. <laughs> oh yeah. the air horns fired up man <laughs> what the fucking shit and fuck wow wow what the fucking shit and fuck indeed there you go <laughs> beautiful Oh, yeah, boy. Well, uh, do you want to do these things before we do the prison burritos? Mm. Sure, yeah, yeah, my, fuck yeah. My, my brother went to the Emerald Isle. That's that's Ireland, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's Gallagher Island. He went to Ireland, and uh, he got me these fucking Kiosk Mature Irish Cheese and Onion Crisps. Not only a name, it's also a sound effect. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So, like oh, wow, they got a formidable stench. Mature cheese. You want to try any of these crisps, Joey? Yeah, and if anybody else wants to try a fucking crisp, they're more than welcome to. He just kind of fucking walked off. Mm. Dripped out, son. Well, that's delicious. God damn, they're awesome. It's really good. Hey, try one of these fucking things, man. Oh, try it. We're going to have Joey try one of these delicious what crisps. It's uh, what up, dog? Mature what Irish up? cheese and onion. They're fucking from... Uh, uh, straight, onion. straight from Ireland. Ireland. They're really fucking good. They taste very mature and they cheesy. They do taste mature. Gluten free. Who knew gluten free could taste good? Right. Yeah. <laughs> the, the the Irish have perfected the art of gluten free. We should make more shit over here. <laughs> right. To do to 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 to. I don't so use the gluten today. That's, that's a five out of five from all around. I believe. Mm, five out of five. Delicious. Thank you, Tony, for those. Should you be listening? I know you are. You son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, boy. Put your hands oh, yeah. in the air. Here, try one of these things. Oh, cool. We're going to have Robbie try one. Yeah, now. let's see what... It is a straight from Ireland, mature Irish cheese and onion. They are delicious. Yeah, yeah I got to say, the onion flavor. It tastes a little Irish. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Here's that. The, the funk of the Irish, huh? <laughs> what do you give it out, out of five? I give it an arbitrary number you out of five. You and make out with your girlfriend. I'm sure she'll love you. All right, that's a five <laughs> out of five. <laughs> <laughs> oh, should we have uh, Robbie play Where's My Fluids Is? Yeah, sure, You want to play a game? You want to play one of our, our segments? Sure. Let's see. Basically, we have a wheel of fluids, and yeah. uh, we spin it, and it lands on one. Uh, there's piss, Ooh. shit, cum, blood, uh, and poop. Where? And I think I said that already anyway. Either way, tears. all these fluids, tears too. All these fluids, it lands on one, you tell us... Your best example of where that fluid has been. Like it's like gonna be blood, piss, shit, puke, tears, or whatever. And uh, you just the story of when one of those, like the time you puked, or in, 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 in a, in a pit. not quite normal place. Yeah. Oh, you want me to tell you about? Yeah. yeah. Let's, oh. let's, so we're gonna the spin wheel. the wheel for you. The wheels are going around. Let's see what you get. And now, oh, it's gonna be. Oh, it's an easy one. It's a very easy one. Piss. Tell us where that piss has been. Oh, it's. it's, it's been, I'm sure it's been some places. Yeah, yeah it's been on, you know, on the ground uh, at bars. Uh, sometimes I miss the toilet. Uh, Do you have a specific? You know, uh, piss out in the woods. Of course, pissing outside. You have like a, f- a favorite place other than your own toilet where you're you're a good just walking down the street and just. You know, if I'm like really drunk or whatever, sometimes I'll just pull it out and just start pissing. He will just pee anywhere. <laughs> yeah, just, Don't give you know, a fuck. I'm giving it a pee trail. I'm, I'm a carefree pisser, you know. <laughs> it's a normal it's wonderful. function, yeah. and so they we'll just have the right to piss wherever they want. It shouldn't be like you know behind closed doors, free, like a free the piss or something. Right? Free, free the piss, everybody. Free free the piss. Piss. Hashtag free the piss. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag free it. I like this game. It's free cool. that piss. Free your mind and I will be kind to you. Yeah, free free your piss. <laughs> Should we, uh, since he spun a wheel, you want to do another one? Yeah, sure, let's go for it. You're going to get come one of these days. Uh, one of these times, I know oh, I'm going to get it. One. That's what I keep saying. <laughs> 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 and tell my friends how many times I've masturbated oh, in their homes. Oh, you see, it just it was so it. close. Puke again, huh? Puke. Uh, let's see. Uh, when I lived in a par- in, in, in a punk house up in Park Falls, Wisconsin, with all these other fucking trash demons, uh, I would get so goddamn drunk and on drugs and whatnot that, you know, in the middle of the night when I had to puke, 
right over the side of the bed. <laughs> no, no attempt to get up or anything. Just puke right on the floor on the side of the bed. Worry about that in the morning. Yeah. I'm never worried about it again. <laughs> <laughs> it is and was where it shall yeah, be. <laughs> that's where it's at now. That puke lives there. Oh fuck yeah! It's new home. <laughs> Hello, pretty good one. Pukey, I like pukey. it. I like it. All right, let's see what's up. Go for it. If you get cum, so help me. <laughs> if I get cum, my wife's gonna be mad. <laughs> oh, oh, you oh, got cum, got it. Cum, right. oh. Tony got the cum. Right. Relief like rolling. Okay, okay. Uh, <laughs> which cum story do I tell? All right, all right. When I was younger, I remember. Um, I got jerked off in the theater and came on the back of the uh, the seat. That's pretty good. That's pretty, uh, you know, That's pretty good. You beat right off in a the theater? Right, no, I got jerked off. I had a oh. hand job. And, oh, okay, okay. Like, you know, the, right, right, right in the popcorn yeah. grease. <laughs> yeah, you could barely tell. It was slippery enough for him. Do, do you remember what movie you were uh, not watching? Fuck no. <laughs> no, I really don't. Damn. It, if I had to wager a guess... <sighs> I'm still done. The borrowers. <laughs> <laughs> the rescuers down under. Yeah. <laughs> Something old. The five old goes to the west. <laughs> Naturally. Well, right on. Man, that was a pretty, pretty good uh, round of where is my fluids is. Nice. There we are. That's a theme song. Fluids. <laughs> Drink it up, motherfuckers. That's right. Drink, drink them fluids. <laughs> Where do they go? <laughs> I don't know. We'll find out where some of them went eventually. Oh, fuck. The longer we do this, we may yeah, know where you know, every fluid where has every been. every ounce of our fluids has been. <laughs> well, good news. Uh, they donated to the sperm bank, too, you know? That's yeah. true. That's follow, true. Follow the wigglers. Follow people out if they want to make a baby or something. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't I, don't have babies I just I just really like giving, you know? <laughs> I, ch- I chip each one of my sperms. <laughs> so I fucking know where they are. <laughs> <laughs> or if they get root worm or anything like mm, that. Yeah, you don't want that. You don't want worms in your sperms. No, 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 no. Probably not good. Don't want worms. You don't want them in your sperm. <laughs> what about dick churros, though? Like <laughs> fucking dick churros. It would be like a jackass dare or something. Like you know, they have those churro extruders and they go through the fryer and just come out and like. Oh my god. <laughs> That'd be rough. Wow, dude. Like sticking your dick into grease? Like hot Not into grease. the grease, but oh. right after it came out of the grease. Oh, I see. Or just have it form-fitted a little bigger, and then you could just wear them for, you know, your... It would be sexy to have all that cinnamon and sticky sugar all over your cock. Like like edible underwear, but it's a dick churro? <laughs> yeah. I'm numb into this. Yeah, I like it. Yeah. <laughs> dick churros, boy. It's <laughs> my new band name. <laughs> dick and the churros. Donald the dicks. <laughs> oh, yeah. Well done. Mm. Oh, Corey and shit, they accepted our uh, challenge. Oh, they did, did they? They did. Uh, he said it's going to be probably next year, though, which uh, always sounds geez. daunting when it's only a couple months. Ah, uh, jeez. He's got the, uh, he's working a bunch during this season, so. All right, well, Corey, fucking goddamn better bring it. <laughs> yeah, he's uh, he's down, though. Obviously, we we spit hot fire right in his face, and yeah. he must respond. So, January 1st. Yeah, <laughs> and fucking the, the better turn, be watching the turn out. of the year. We will be what fucking ready for you. We challenged them to a rap battle. Yeah. Oh, you guys gonna battle rap? Yeah, yeah. 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 Cool. It's gonna be it's gonna be ridiculous. It should be pretty fun though. Hell yeah. Well, uh, at this point, we should pretty much take an intermission. Uh, when mm. we come back, we might have a new song. We might have a song by a guest. I don't know. We might be eating prison burritos. Who the fuck even cares? I don't know. Bye. <laughs> nice. All right. That was good. Finish it, we're in his 
And that was Junkyard by Army of Cretans here on WT... Wait, no, uh, that's a different episode. Uh, that, <laughs> but that was Junkyard by Army of Cretans, donated to us by our lovely guests. Great yeah, song, great Rob, song. Robbie and Joey and Chris and Randy, rude. Actually, the, actually, I guess we're the guests. Guys, we're, we're in Robbie's yeah, house. So. Fuck yeah, you never know where we're going to be. Just chilling in some corner somewhere, talking some bullshit. We're going to show up wherever you are, and we're going to take your milk money. Speaking of fucking corners. Oh, no. And yes, ladies and gentlemen, it is now that time again for a new episode of Bird Corner. We got a we got a couple few bird corners, I think, today. Yeah, there's a couple. We can this would be a fun filled bird corner. Yeah, man. I'll tell you the first one that I had though, besides the ones we were addressing earlier off right. mic, um, is I seen this turkey vulture come down mm-hmm. when I was driving out by Antioch to uh, going out there. And uh, it just grabbed what looked like maybe a cat or a rabbit. Oh, no. It was too picked clean. It was just oh, a, basically no. bones and sinew and a, like floppy. <laughs> and this turkey vulture is trying to fly the fuck away with it. <laughs> it's a little too heavy and he keeps fucking... Oh, I, man. There was no one on this. It was kind of in the county, so I kind of went as slow as I could to see if he ever got off. I think, I think he finally snapped off a bone and made off with that. But Gosh darn. It was pretty, uh, That's it was pretty, pretty hellraiser <laughs> Well, before we get to the other one that we addressed on the way here, uh, I seen the big bird flying over old uh, Route 120 there when I was driving the other day, the big heron that I like to hang around the neighborhood. Hey, I love, like seeing that guy around. Hell yeah. That's the only bird corner I got, except <laughs> we do have an unfortunate, sad bird corner for when we were driving up to uh, Robbie's house today from my house. Yeah, b- bird down. Bird. Bird down. Bird got a little bold yeah. trying to uh, fly in front of uh, Tony's vehicle there. He did not make it. No, I don't think. I think it was a sparrow. It was yeah, a little little sparrow or a chickadee or something. It was poor, it was poor, 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 poor one out for a little bird boy. Poor little guy. Oh. But that's but that's bird corner for you. Yeah, the bird I corner can. giveth and the bird corner <laughs> taketh away. <laughs> it does. Yeah. Bird corner, bird corner, bird corner. <laughs> Speaking of gore, I finally we made it to Texas uh, Chainsaw Massacre three. No oh boy. Uh, yeah, wow. Well, boy, oh did that boy. go down. Boy, did that. <laughs> and I uh, we we went through it. We made it through there. It was pretty awful. Uh, and then the Leatherface one that you had seen. Oh, yeah. No, I couldn't finish that one. That was wasn't so the one bad. I saw. I saw, I told you, the 2003 remake. Oh, figured, that's right. That's out. right. That also has its own prequel, and they're all garbage. Yeah, I'm sure. Oh, my God. <sighs> just, they, just, they just don't make them like they used to, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> they don't. Ah, yeah, the, the Leatherface one, that 2017 awful film. Yeah. Couldn't make it through. It was too bad. Very, very unfortunate that you had to sit through that. <laughs> Speaking of having to sit through things after, how was your, uh, how was that hot ship thing? Oh, <laughs> man. Well, I'm sure everybody who would be listening to this has seen it as well, but I went ahead and did the Packy one chip challenge where it's one tortilla chip in a coffin box. What's the pepper again? The peppers. Peppers, uh, oh, shit, it's you, it's, it's got the, 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 uh, the, uh chipotle pepper in there it's just roasted jalapeno oh, yeah yeah so it's got jalapeno it's got ghost pepper and then the the creme de la creme is the uh carolina reaper okay. which 
allegedly, this goes back and forth between shit like Scorpion and all that, but uh, basically the, the hottest pepper you can get. Oh, boy. Uh, I don't do a whole lot of spicy things, really, so that was 120% pure torture for me. I, <laughs> I, I, I took it as well as I could, but you can see the video online, fucking on Facebook or on YouTube, it's out there. You can see me crying and snotting and sweating, <laughs> cursing my life, Dan, chugging, chugging all the milk. Yeah, Dan got a funny screenshot. <laughs> yeah, Dan Betcher got an excellent screenshot that he says he's going to make buttons out of. So look out for those, too. <laughs> oh, man. That's the good stuff. I could smell that fucking burrito cooking. Oh, man. yeah. So, so Robbie is hard at work right now cooking up some delicious, delicious old-fashioned prison-style food. Oh, old-fashioned. Deep I, can, down. I can really, I can smell the ramen already. That's really what's filling the air. I yeah, think. yeah. Uh, I feel I heard. I got a waft of that myself. Yeah, yeah. Oh man, it's just making my mouth water. Speaking, <laughs> 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 speaking of shit that doesn't make my mouth water. Did uh, you, uh, you ever eat at this hoo hot place? I, what? Hoo hot. It's called H U H O T. No. It's a fucking. What it is, is you go in there and, like, you pick... There's, like, a salad bar, if you will, with, mm -hmm. like, frozen meats and mushrooms. Oh, I've and been to places like that, bowl, yeah. I've been to places like that. And you like fucking that. sit and wait around, but there's, like, sauce on the floor, and then you're basically <laughs> you're basically just fucking standing the whole time, like a lunch line. <laughs> right, yeah, and no, I've, I've been to a place like that. I didn't mind it because I had buddies who worked there, so it was always free for me. Yeah. But I couldn't imagine just going there because uh, you want to. Yeah, I, and i got to serve myself, make my own bowl, right, fucking yeah. stand there while you cook it. and that, that's fucking a, go home and cook it yourself, it'll be much better. That's my novelty that I get from this place. <laughs> Fuck you. You get to assemble your own meal, and yeah. the only thing they do is cook it and bring it you up You want to me you. to cook it, too. Fuck. <laughs> they, you, they may as well just let you it fucking cook it at your table. Fucking Have a little grill there and fucking do be, it up. Beyond mediocre. I, I've been forced to go there a couple times. The last time it was so awful, I, would, <laughs> I never will go. I'll wait in the car if that's the other alternative. Yeah, there was this place, BD's Mongolian Grill in okay. fucking Vernon Hills, and my same buddies worked there. It's the exact same shit. And then shit. they flick their little spatulas on the thing and make yeah. them ting around. Yeah, like those. ready to try them? Or oh, yeah, shit, yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. Fucking, can you bring them to us, or do we have to go get them from you? I can bring them. I'll get them. All okay. right, cool. Here we go. Oh, shit, man. Oh, man. Full service. Full service here at, at Casa Rabi. Casa de Cretans. <laughs> this just in. We're going to eat food, because we're fat. <laughs> Here comes our first taste of a jailhouse burrito. Yeah, you know, I've never been inside before, so I don't I don't really know the, the ins and outs of the of the of the cuisine of our penal system. I had a banana bread and then I had a dude make me a burrito, but it didn't have the meat. It was a different recipe mm. than he's showing me. Okay, okay. I'm, <laughs> I'm very curious. <laughs> yeah, it should be. I, I'm expecting nothing but strange deliciousness. Some what? What? However you yeah, do it, however, man. Yeah, however you guys do it in, in your house, man. Fucking. He's just asking he, if we want jalapenos. Yeah, he yeah. Mother, fuck yeah, boy. Pretty much. I mean, why not get the full experience? And then we, and then we have to shit in front of each other after we eat it, right? <laughs> <laughs> get the full, full, 4D immersive experience. <laughs> Sounds amazing. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm into it. Super into it. <laughs> Need a I, I feel like a feel like a superhero with this music. It's gonna be the most epic burrito eating that's capes. ever happened. We have capes. They're just backwards and made of fat. That's true. That's true. They do so cascade and drape down the body mm -hmm. it's a superpower folks it is a superpower it's not a it's not a handicap like some people try to claim oh, right. yeah, yeah, oh my yeah, goodness please. here Hell it goes yeah. all right there, there you go the this looks <laughs> first of all this looks amazing <laughs> yeah yeah on a flour tortilla here all right we'll fold her up we got a flour tortilla with with the guts that just look Looks like how it sounds. It's ramen and chili cheese and jalapenos and I'm some guessing meat. Today. Some sausage. Summer sausage for yep. for meat. Yep. That's All wrapped up in a big old flour torte. 
Yeah, this is what you can purchase off the canteen in our correctional institutions in here in the great state of Wisconsin. Mm. Yo, man. This doesn't taste anything worse like what you get at Taco Bell. No? Mm. <laughs> it tastes a lot like Taco Bell. Right? That's what I'm saying. Yeah. yeah. It's got a very Taco Bell-like flavor to it, and that's that's cool by me. Cool. Yeah, this is fuck, dude. Send me, send me away. Three hots in a cot, dude. I'm in. Yeah. <laughs> in like Flynn. I've been trying to avoid it my whole life, but I've been wrong. <laughs> hey, Dick Reeds, that just sounds like smashed chips and noodles. How can you sustain your fat Dick Reed lives like this? I don't know, dude. You'd have to be human, robot. You know, you don't get it, man. Negative. Mm, indeed, but yeah, I'm duly impressed. Very yeah, good. It's fucking good. Right. Yeah, yeah. That's just a... I am a robot. Oh, shit. I am a beautiful fucking machine. <laughs> yeah, a lot of guys, you know, in a joint, they'll get together on the weekends and they'll all pitch in, you know. Hell yeah. Everyone will, like, contribute and have burrito parties. And, yeah, you, you know, bring the cars and cribbage and... Anything to stay what? sane, I imagine, yeah, man. It's, fucking know, it's like, like a comfort food, you know, for guys that are going through struggles or... Or it's a comfort food on the outside if you just miss that life, you know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yep. I'm sure people definitely miss jail. I don't know. <laughs> no. well, I'm sure. I'm glad I'm a free man now. Mm. Yeah, I met a few motherfuckers that are just fine out in there. No, thank you. Oh, man. Enjoy our, our wonderful mm. eating noises mm. while we devour these. <laughs> sure. Yeah. 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 It tastes good, too, in the morning. Like, you put it in the fridge. You know, I, you, know you order well, this is, pizza. This is, this is a hangover buster right here. Yeah, you know, for real. Fucking... Oh, yeah. Oh man, beautiful! Our, our last bean. Oh, thanks, buddy. No problem. Dude, that was awesome. <laughs> Let's try. Thank you. Finish him. Hell yeah. Mission completed. Mm. <laughs> it was mission, mission mission complete indeed. Mission accomplished. Oh man. So I suppose, ladies and gentlemen. Oh no, I got one more segment, dude. Oh, we got another segment. Holy yeah, shit. this one's called Working at the Porn Store Stories. Oh fuck. Oh, oh, shit. Working at the porn store. <laughs> <laughs> some stories. Hey, tell, tell Sherry, I'm going to finish up this burrito. Ah, so, <laughs> so I, I don't know if I told any of these yet on here. So, I used to work at that porn store for a while. And my brother worked there for quite a few years, more than I did. So, I was around there quite a bit. Uh, one time I was working there. <laughs> Now, believe me, there are cruisers that go around and try to blow dudes all the time. Mm -hmm. And what they'll do is, the, when you put a quarter in, the TV goes on and the light goes off. But they'll, like, try to unscrew the light bulb and just sit and jerk off in the corner and, like, wait as for... As you do. As you do. And some dude would come around and they'd be like, you need some help in there. And, then, <laughs> and that's how it didn't really take much. The romance is gone. Sure, that's all sure. I got to say. Sure, dead there, man. So I, all the time, I, you, if a cop comes in or something and catches that going on, the guy at the desk gets the fucking ticket. Mm -hmm. So I, I ain't about to have that on my record. So you keep an eye on these dudes and you get to know the ones that are habitually doing this. Well, there was one time on the weekend I go back there. And there's this old dude, and I'm talking like 80 years old, late 70s. Methuselah old. Bald, with just a little wispy white hair, <laughs> just on his knees, blowing some trucker dude. Lovely. Fucking, I'm like, hey man, you gotta go. You know, it's I kicked a few people off for doing this. It's not the end of the I world. Mean, just whatever. get out of here. I'm about to judge your life. You know. <laughs> But he got all pissed off at me. He was like, yeah, bro, he's pulling an attitude with me. I'm like, look, wow. man, I'm not the one on, in a porn store on my knees <laughs> sucking some dude's dick. So you can you're, probably just go. You're the go. desperate one here. Yeah, you're not giving us any money. You're not. What are you doing, man? Get out of here. You know, it's that's that's beautiful. Shoo, shoo. <laughs> shoo, shoo. Uh, you bought me. That's wonderful. That was working, working at the porn store. <laughs> It's very good. Episode very one. Good. That's that, that will likely be a recurring segment. Yeah, I got a bunch of them, man. Hell yeah. I can't fucking see it. I just can't. You okay? Because you don't have eyeballs. Yeah, man. You got to really just use the eyeballs in your mind, man. Whatever. All right. Well, on that <laughs> on note, that note, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies. And gentlemen. You know what those horns mean. 
And this has been a great episode. We gotta get old pants on. He's getting cranky. I'd like to. I'd like to thank. <laughs> I'd like to thank Robbie for his hospitality. Yeah, his thank you, Robbie. Culinary expertise. Thanks for Army of Cretans for letting us use the intermission song. Thanks, thanks to Joey for trying a potato chip. Thanks to every little kid that's under five foot two that likes lamps. Thanks to everybody listening, if you've made it this far. <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, we were two fat guys on the internet. We are two fat guys on the internet. And, you know, I'm going to go ahead and say right now, we are always going to be two fat guys on the internet. So, go, go fuck, fuck yourself. yourself.